Another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> ah. Now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. Indeed. Treat it well, and you shall find no more dependable a wand than one with a unicorn hair core. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new one's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Alright, thank you. Alright. You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who is this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Ranrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. Your clientele's not what it used to be, Sarona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. I said, my friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, Theophilus. The Three Broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butterbeer forever. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls, Ranrock, and Rookwood. What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything, but it's perhaps best I do that later. Professor, I'm glad to see you. And I you. Thank Merlin you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? Sir, the trolls were wearing armor. It had that dark glow like the dragon collar. Goblin silver. Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? A 
And why send trolls to... They were there because of me. I overheard Ranrock talking with Victor Rookwood. Ranrock was in Hogsmeade? With Rookwood? The trolls were Ranrock's distraction so that Rookwood could get to me. And he would have, had Sorona and the patrons at the Three Broomsticks not intervened. This is grave news indeed. If Ranrock's goblins and dark wizards are after you, they want what we found in that vault. Well, that sounds like a problem. Renwick would want the locket. Sir, what about the goblins in Gringotts? Speaking of the vault, do you think that Ranrock is working with any of the goblins at Gringotts? I do not. Gringotts goblins aren't typically the friendliest of beings, but they have a great deal of integrity. No, I dare say after what happened to that poor banker, the goblins at Gringotts are no followers of Ranrock. Well, that's good to know. They're after the locket. You said you discovered something in it. Yes, yes. I discovered an inscription. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. Clever enchantment. It's a map of Hogwarts, to be sure. But I do not know where it leads. It leads to the library. A restricted section, to be precise. And a bit beyond. I see traces of magic there on the map. I suspected you would see something. Shall we go? I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But if our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. I'd like you to work with Professor Heckett a bit before we continue. But sir, how dangerous could the library be? Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after a book, but we should be prepared for anything. Once you've honed your defensive magic further, come and see me. I'll let yeah. Professor Heckett know to expect you. All right, cool. All right. All right, on my way to to my next classroom. Oh, report to Heckat. Heckat. Okay. If I'm pronouncing it wrong, I apologize. All school is clearly like a maze when I'm trying to get to somebody. Oh, jeez. There goes the eyes again. Ah, I believe we have some matters to discuss. I'm here about the new spell you wanted to teach me, Professor. Good. Professor Fig indicated a certain urgency to you completing your defensive magic assignments. As such, you are to learn Incendio, the fire-making spell. Oh, here we go. Torches, burning away spider webs, and when necessary, defending against those who would wish to do us harm. Sounds uh, versatile. Quite. But before we get started, I'd like you to complete a few tasks. You may okay. be surprised by some of them. Astonishing how much students don't think their professors know. When you're finished, come and see me. Then we shall begin working on Incendio. Okay, cool. You know where uh, to find me once you've finished. Alright, so let's see. Ooh, okay. Well, I definitely know... Oh, I know this area. I don't know how I got this, but... I'm not complaining. I'll take it. It's straight ahead. Hi, buddy. How's it going? Alright. Oh, this is so cool. I know this area. Yeah, I know this area. Oh, am I doing the whole dueling thing? Can I help you? Uh, yeah, I think so. Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinate duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. Well, that's nice to hear. Uh, okay, that sounds like an insult right there. I'm flattered to hear that. Sebastian's not a bad duelist either. Imagine it's quite something to see the two of you duel. How does cross ones work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end, wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. 
interested? Now I'll join your club. Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in Crossed Ones, you can duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? I'm in. Get me in the ring. Spectacular! Let the fireworks begin! All right, here we go. We'll make you regret signing up. Okay, good luck with that. Target the... okay. Oh. Okay, this is probably going to take me a while to get used to it. Nice try. Oh, hold on, hold on. Oh, there we go. All right. Oh, no. Uh, okay, I gotta be sure to die. There we go. Perhaps one day I'll sign up for a round. Nice work. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. In fact, the second duel is ready when you are. And as a fully initiated member, you now have access to the official Crossed Ones training dummy. Very good way to master spell combinations. Come and see me, and I'll set it up. Again, right. congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. Alright, cool, thank you. Hope to see you back here again. Yeah, probably. Why am I going back over here? Oh. Um, win two rounds of the cross... Oh. Oh, so I gotta do it again. Hello, Lucan. May I use the training dummy? Of course. I'll fetch it and give you a list of combinations to practice. Ready to have a try now? That would be wonderful. Be sure to cast all your spells before the dummy lands. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. Oh. Next time. Oh. Okay, I messed something up. All right. Okay. All right. So I gotta slow down with the whole trigger. There we go. I'd say that's enough practice. You looked good out there. Thank you, Lucan. I say better to discover one's weaknesses during practice than during a duel. You'll be a fearsome challenger now. Well, still a few bumps here and there, but it's a work in progress. Let's see. Next time you need a partner for Cross Swans, don't hesitate to call on me. All right. Oh, again? Oh, I still have to Hello, do that Lincoln. other one. Is the next round of Cross Swans all set? Why, yes, it is. I've got a great match lined up. Ready for another round? Yep. I'm ready. Let's do it. Brilliant. Are you dealing with a partner? Um. Scored Nat. 
I'll just I'll just call her Nat to make it easier. Yes, Natty. Then let's get to it. Or Natty, that can work. Ready to get thrashed? Apologies in advance. All right, here we go. Ooh, okay. Break through the targets. Violet shields with four spells. Summon charm. Accio. Okay. Accio. Oh, whoops. Okay. Nice try. Okay, just keep dealing with them. Watch your head. Nice try. There we go. Okay. Bravo! I gave it my all. You did indeed. The other duelists have already taken notice of you. But after that last round, they'll really have it in for you. You'd better keep practicing if you want a chance at winning. <laughs> or at least surviving the next round. Yeah, that's I'll true. You already. Hope to see you then. Okay, cool. The next round is for all the gobstones, so to speak. Alright. Alright. Assignment's all finished. All right, let's try, okay, turn around. Hold on. Here we go. All right, travel. At least uh, travel is actually getting handy for me to be able to go around here and there. Source indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. All right. I'm looking forward to that incendio spell you were telling me about. I trust Mr. Brattleby was able to accommodate you and that you found success in your endeavors. Yep. I finished all of the tasks you gave me, Professor Hackett. Glad to hear it. Then you should be ready to learn incendio. Should be, Professor. Yes. I'm sorry to say I visited enough careless colleagues at St. Mungo's to assure you that fire is a fickle servant. Your spellcasting has impressed me thus far, but please maintain focus. I would rather we not end today's lesson with your robes aflame. Let us begin. And remember, focus on the proper wand movement. Okay. All right, here we go. And keep your wand steady. There we go. All right. So let's. Good work. Okay. Lumos, I probably might need that. Okay. Um, use the spell. You must first add the spell set. Hover. Over incendio, hold and tap face. You would like. Ah, okay. All right, I got it. Now I have incendio. Okay, so it's a heavy damage. Um. Okay, where do I? Oh man, I gotta go back up there. Alright, let's see. Okay, so before I just wind up confusing myself again. How did this work? I think it's 
here. Wait, nope. Okay. Did that take me where I need to go? Okay, go to another downstairs. Here we go. Now this is the place. Alright. Okay, Fig, I'm back. What do you got for me? Ah, there you are. All right, I'm ready to go. Hello, sir. You'll be pleased to know that I worked on my defensive magic with Professor Heckard. So I hear. She tells me you've taken rather well to your new wand. You must continue to work with her and your other professors to improve your skills. That said, I don't wish to postpone our visit to the library any longer. So, shall we proceed? Fig, I have work for you. Come. Headmaster, I'm with a student and my schedule Your is... schedule will wait indefinitely, as will your student. I would think that after all the trouble you caused me with Osric, you'd be eager to make amends. My office, five minutes. Oh, that was... That man is exasperating. Unfortunately, our trip to the restricted section will have to wait a bit longer. But, Professor... We have no choice. It would be unwise to provoke our illustrious headmaster further. I shall find you when I've completed whatever toils I must endure. Oh, we'll talk to Sebastian. Okay, so it looks like this is my only solution to talk to Sebastian. So he is downstairs. All right. Okay, so well, wrong way. All right, let's go. Okay, here he is. All right. Sebastian, there you are. I was hoping to see you. I was in the three broomsticks after the troll attack and saw what happened with Rookwood and Harlow. Not many students have Victor Rookwood's attention. What was that all about? It's to do with Ronrock. Ronrock. Well, I don't know what he's after for me, so I'm not entirely sure. I've never even met him. Perhaps he oh. mistook me for another student. I guess I just lied to him. Say so. I won't press you now, but you will have to tell me what's going on at some point. You might need me. So, why were you looking for me? I need to find something for Professor Fig, but it's in the restricted section of the library. <laughs> he can't get it himself? He was called away by Black at the last moment. I suppose I could wait to get a note from him, but... You want to show some initiative. Precisely. You mentioned being clever enough not to get caught in the restricted section. And I am. Meet me outside the library tonight, and tell no one. Oh, uh, okay. See you tonight. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll meet you later. All right. Oh boy, this is gonna be this is gonna be a bit of a trip. Now I'm gonna be sneaking in. Oh wait, maybe I don't have to. I guess I'm not in my common room. See there? That's the door we need to reach. And those annoying prefects would love nothing more than to rat on us to Scribner. So don't let them see us. Understood? I can be sneaky. Let's go. Hold on now. There's a spell you should know. The disillusionment charm. Good for getting places you're not supposed to be. Is that the clogging one? And you'll appear as little more than a trick of the light. Just as long as you keep your distance and stay quiet. You mean I'll actually be able to turn invisible? Something like that. Here we go. There's a cloak. But those are expensive. And spells, spells are free. 
Give it a try. Okay. All right, here we go. There we go. Sweet. All right. I know about this. Okay, so I may need to switch this one. Whoa, where are you going, buddy? Whoa, is that just me? I think that's just me. Whoa. How long does this wear off? Well, that's a problem. Okay. for it okay um, if I can see you the prefects might be able to as well be careful Way too close. You told me the librarian would be gone by now. I said usually, but it'll still be all right. Do you see her desk behind me? The key yes. is in the drawer of that desk. Now, here's what we're going to do. I'll create a distraction to draw her away. You focus on getting the key. I'll meet you outside of the restricted section. I want to ask him, why does he need the key? Wait, why do we need a key? Isn't there a spell for this? Hello, Homora. That's how I always used to get in. But the librarian twigged that I knew the spell and cast an anti Alohomora charm on the lock. So now it's just this key. But don't worry. I said I'd get you in, and I always keep my word. Trust me. Is someone there? Is that you, Peeves? The key. Here All right, got the key. That wasn't so difficult after all. Now to find that book. All right, here we go. Use a blast cast while undetected, luring, okay. Okay, I did not know I could do that. All right. Ghost, don't let her see you. What ghost? Is it this one? 
Oh, okay. Well, that was that, that clearly came out of nowhere. Yeah, let's try that again. Let's try that again. Well, that's my first failure in this. Probably, probably way too close. At least I can still be able to. All right. Alright, here we go. Ghost, don't let her see you. Revelion. Okay, I forgot I can be able to do that. we go. All right. Should be in the clear. There's no need for us to be skulking about. So what is it you've been looking for? I'm looking for a cure to help my twin sister, Anne, so that she can return to Hogwarts. Because Merlin knows everyone else has given up. Why do you think we'll find a cure in the restricted section? Does the Hogwarts matron have nothing that can help Anne? No. We've tried everyone from Nurse Blaney to St. Mungo's. But I can research on my own. No need to concern yourself with that right now. Let's focus on what you're after. Which is what, precisely? I'll know it when I see it. You're being awfully cryptic. Okay. I'll find the book. Okay, so it's almost here. I'm not gonna take any chances in case if there is indeed ghosts around. Who have we here? Oh boy. Sebastian Solo and his new little friend. Out and you must be peeps. They shouldn't be. Naughty, naughty. You'll get caught. Peeves, don't you? I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell. I'm going to tell. Come on. Oh, blasted peeves! I've got to stop him or at least get to the librarian with a good excuse for all of this. Don't get in trouble. I don't want you getting into trouble for me. I have a way with the faculty when it comes to disciplinary matters. Besides, I like having friends who are in my debt. Now go. Good luck in your search. Now, where has that damned poltergeist got to? Okay, now I gotta repair it. Zona. All right. Repair. All right. I have no idea what kind of hat that is, but okay. All right, all the way down. Yeah, this castle is definitely big. What is that? Of course, traces of ancient magic. There must be more to it. That's it. Whoa. Well, I can't jump down. Yeah, I can't even jump down. So, I, so this time I gotta run. Where might this lead? All right. So where am I going? It, 
Is this where I have to use Akio? Okay, discover the secret of the Revelio. Discover the I need to wake up that rune over there. Oh, okay. Oh, God. Okay, that came out of nowhere. Incendio. Well, that did nothing. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Run, run, run. Okay. Not surprising. Guards at the ready. All right, time to. Uh, yeah, I should probably consider having this. Yeah, stick with these ones for now. All right. Not yet. I don't want to use it. All right, I guess I'm Thor now. Hi, how's it going? Oh, I'm sorry. Whoa, where did you come from? There we go. I just clearly cut off a knight's head clean off. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, that was Thor magic I just used. Oh, good. More. Okay, I really need to keep an eye on my health this time because I can't, I can't, like, I can't, like, keep passing for order. Everything's gonna be fine here and there. It's not like Spider Man that I don't need to deal with my Tronus. Come on. How long do I need to keep this up? Okay, discover the secret. Okay. Whoa, getting too close to the edge. God. Oh, that was way too close. <clears throat> this must okay. be forward, but to where?
Okay. Alright. Let's try this again. I actually took a little longer than it should have. Oh, good. More of this. Alright. This time I gotta concentrate. Alright, here we go. How did that hit me? Whoa. Well, thank you for that, buddy. Oh, this is going to be a problem. Okay. Well, that was clearly crazy. All right. Is it that the book? Is a book after all. But what kind of book, though, is the curious part. So he created rain for them. You wanted to see me, Headmistress Fitzgerald, Professor Rackham. Miss Isadora Morganach, welcome. Professor Rookwood, Professor Bacar. We understand that you are adjusting well to life at Hogwarts. I am. I am glad. Especially in light of your unusual situation, starting as a fifth year. 
As it happens, I was also admitted to Hogwarts as a fifth year. I have never heard of another like us. Miss Morganock, when we spoke yesterday after class, you asked about the beautiful swirls you saw years ago when we visited your hamlet. I recognized you all immediately. I cannot thank you enough for what you did. We were glad to help. And yes, I did see swirls of magic everywhere that day. My father insists it was my imagination running wild, but it was certainly real to me. It was not your imagination. Percival, Professor Rackham can see them too, but we have never known of another who could. I don't understand. What are they? The whispers or traces that appear when a particular form of ancient magic is wielded. Ancient magic? Few are capable of wielding it. Hogwarts itself is a stronghold of ancient magic. So if I can see traces of ancient magic, does that mean I can wield it too? With the proper training. But let us not get ahead of ourselves, Miss Morkanak. Before I can train you to wield such magic, you must first master all that Hogwarts has to offer. A magic this powerful can do great harm in the wrong hands. It must be wielded by a select few. Okay. I ask that you not speak to anyone about what we have discussed here today. Okay. Sebastian. Sneaking in the restricted section again! I had thought we were through with this mischief. Clearly, detentions are insufficient. I'm afraid I must take this to the headmaster. But that being said, Peeves informs me that you didn't come alone tonight. If someone has coerced you, I would have you tell me. You're a bright boy. Don't waste this. There was nobody else. I came alone. Oh, Sebastian. What will your uncle say? <laughs> Uh, do I need to get out of here? Okay, so something tells me I really do need to get out of here. Okay. Ooh, all the way up there. All the way up there. Okay. All right, keep moving. All right, travel. Okay, thought for one second that she was upstairs or Sebastian. Well, here we go, Professor Fig. All right. All right. Hold on, before I do that. Cannot be serious. Goblins working with Rookwood makes no sense. It is rather unorthodox, to say the least. Unorthodox? It's inconceivable. It's... Ah, Fig. You have a visitor. I'll see what I can find out. Hmm. Sir, I was able to search the restricted section while you were with Professor Black. It was a book we were after. What? That's... Wait. You access the restricted section? But how? Thinking on it, perhaps it's best you spare me the details. 
<laughs> Fair enough. In fact, the book was below the restricted section as it appeared on the map. I want to hear everything. First, let's have a look. Okay. What are we looking at? Oh, there's a page missing. Oh, oh dear. Some of these pages seem to be missing. Oh, there's it more. Appears someone has got to the book before us. Still, I will need time to study what remains. Perhaps we can still salvage something useful. It may take some time. I wonder why okay. it was here, below Hogwarts. I think I know, sir. I saw two more memories where I found the book. Another pensive, Godric's heart. The man we saw before, Percival Rackham, was a professor here. The first memory showed him and three other professors using ancient magic to restore a hamlet from a drought. Miriam was right. And the second memory? They were talking to a student who started as a fifth year, like I did. She could see traces of magic too. Why those memories? Hmm. Perhaps this book will explain. Now I'll have to take it with me to London. The headmaster has insisted that I speak directly to the minister about George's death. Ah, uh, I probably do not know. I probably do not want to know. What will you tell them? I understand. I'll see what I can learn about the missing pages while you're gone. Good. Don't neglect your studies. Your wand work is improving by the day. But you'll want to pay attention in herbology and potions. There's more to magic than spell casting. Plenty to keep me occupied while you're gone. You've done exceptionally well. I look forward to seeing all that you've accomplished when I return.